Time to welcome our first couple now. Their angelic rumba wasn't to all the judges' tastes, but to us, it was a little slice of heaven. It's David and Nadia. No, I... As a dance, I loved it, but as a rumba, I didn't. There wasn't enough basic steps. There was no flow for me from movement to movement. You have a beautiful feeling, but that's not enough for me in this dance. The overall performance was very, very nice. They loved it. Uh, never mind what the judges say. Well, you got lost in your performance, that character. I mean, you really gave yourself that yeah, dance Yeah, didn't you? I really did. And, I, you know, I had issues with the rumba early on in the week. And then when we went out and performed, I loved every minute of it. I thought it was a really haunting performance. As a performance, uh, it was one I enjoyed probably well, up there with some, some of the best of the others I'd done, um, which I didn't expect because I knew how hard the rumba was going to be. I'd been warned. By and Nadia, how hard it was going to be. For men, exactly. You know? Why is it so hard for the men, Nadia? Why, you know, why is that? Uh, because he has to do all the leading, and because it's yeah. so exposed, he he has to use his body as much as he can, and all the footwork and everything. It's mm. just so many details, and you can see every small mistake. But he didn't do any. No mistakes. No Good mistakes. boy. That was amazing. And that's the thing. Sometimes people go a bit like that when there's a rumba. Yeah. But I think everybody really enjoyed well, it. Well, well not everybody. <laughs> well, yeah. We'll get on to the judges. Yeah, uh, they were saying that they wanted more basic. Nadia, now you did the choreography. What did you say? I about? did the choreography. So uh, they were talking about Kukaracha, and actually, first four bars, it was him doing Kukaracha. So I don't know why they missed it. Probably because of his. Yes, short. maybe they maybe. were looking somewhere else. else. Yeah. And then it was Rumba walks into the telemark telespin, into the swivels, yeah. into the overturn, into the pivots, <laughs> into the fan. There's into a list, the people. Yeah, that's rumba. There is a list. I mean, rumba. Uh, yeah. So there we go. <laughs> well, good answer. I think. So, were you hoping for a list course? I mean, a couple of sevens in there, but to getting a five. Yeah, that, that was that tough. But I mean, painful. what Craig was saying about you know enjoying the performance was lovely as well. But it yeah. obviously to get a five after that it was, it was a bit of a shame. But but you know what? It was very fulfilling to do that dance after quite a tough week trying to learn it and knowing how difficult it was. So um, you know, everybody has their own opinion on it. But um, to, to know that he liked it as a performance and enjoyed it as a performance was good because we certainly did. And he did definitely say that he would like to watch you all day. I mean, yeah. that's slightly concerning. <laughs> <laughs> um, it was really lovely to see your telly mum, Bonnie Langford, yes. there in the audience. Uh, she was really enjoying your performance. She did look quite concerned, a little bit cross, actually, when the judges were giving their critique. Mm. Did she go over, you know, like any good mum, and have a stern word with I them? I had to restrain her. Mum was looking <laughs> after her boy. Um, but, no, she's so supportive. And beforehand, she brought me all the stuff that she knows I like, you know, before when she comes to the show, like, yeah. you know, like protein bars and stuff and energy oh. drinks and go look after yourself. And she's brilliant. And it was lovely to have her actually in the audience there. So she and she loved the performance. So, you know, that makes me really happy. Yeah, really I happy. know. She's yeah. like telling mum like a yeah. real mum. Yeah, exactly. You've got so many mums, you're so <laughs> lucky. Now, onwards and upwards, quite literally, because it's American smooth mm. and you get to do lifts. You get to lift. <laughs> Which excites us greatly. Um, and for you two, will they be fun now they're not... Illegal. I know we've done, <laughs> we've done two illegal lifts already up to this point, and we get three legal, legal. lifts. So, and we just want to make them as spectacular as we can. Yeah. And you know, use the opportunity to do something like that, and, and, and show a kind of different side to our performances. So, so far, we, I, I'm absolutely loving it. But you know, mix it in there with the dance, making it all work. We, we're working on it. Working but on um, it. I yeah. think if it works well, it's going to look really great. You've got some great music. It's yes. Natalie Cole. Listen. This will be I'm getting well get into this She's today. Involved. I know. Good. I'll be storming onto the floor. I <laughs> uh, must warn you, though, that we do have eyes and ears everywhere mm. when you're training. We've picked up some interesting sounds from your training room recently. Mm. Uh, <laughs> bang. 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 I like that. I'm so I mean, excited. I think I have a problem. <laughs> I love it. I must tell you something really lovely. Darren Bennett was on. He's one of the kings of the dance world. And he said that he really loves you too when he was on Choreography Corner. And he feels that oh you need God. your breakout dance. Could this American Smooth be the one, do you think? I really think so, because he's really enjoying this dance. I am really loving it more yeah. than I had any other from 
day one. So, uh, you know, I hope I can do it justice. I really do. Oh. The choreography is great as well. So. Exactly. <laughs> Are we going up with? Going to make some Very noise. Exactly. Oh, uh, make yeah. loads of noises. <laughs> we love it. Good luck, David and Nadia. Thank you. Thank you.